legal departments, you race in front of them, the buses are moved. We've never... Over the road, sir, which you, people have moved there before for me, it's public. We, we've always come here for like four years now. Sir, I just haven't said, so, sir, it is public land. If you just move that far and just over the road, that'd be great. Well, I just, I, I would so gladly... So you're really saying the same thing, this is university property here on the, on the footpath. Sir... Are you saying that as well? We've just been asked to move either way from yeah. Is this university no, land or council land? This is our property. It's university we pay land. Tax Could, is, is this no, council it's land? Square, this is, this is, is this council land? land? No, sir, it's university square. So, so, it's not, so it's not council land? It's university square, sir. We've come here for like four sir, years. Sir, Can, you the show us the Can you show us information that it is? Sir, we just need to know. Because we've been coming here for four years. I know, sir, but we've had me for Christians, so we, we, we will gladly move. If this is university land, we'll gladly move. Sir, the message but, of love and peace of Jesus. Sir, sir, listen, we will move if this is university land. Well, sir, it is known as university square. But we have come here. Know, that, that doesn't mean it's university sir, land. People have been moved on with, all, with, with, all, with due respect, sir, sir, if you show us that this is your land, we'll move. But we've been coming here for four sir, years, sir. I'm and I've never been never been moved at all. So if you let me speak, I've informed of the information we have that this is university land. We've been asked to explain but you must say we've been very nice. Well we've we've come we've come Can you show it up? You could be saying anything and if we have evidence we'll move. Well for one thing we don't like. Well if you give us evidence we'll move sir. If you give us evidence we'll move sir. We're glad to be moved. Unfortunately I don't have access to the Well we'll keep preaching sir until you show us evidence sir. Well sir in that case Okay. In that case sir, well first of all sir we don't like. But sir, we're, we're not saying. Sir, just sir, just sir if this is if this is Liverpool land, we will. If this is the university land, we will gladly move, sir. We will gladly move because it's your land. But we've been coming here four years here, and we've never been moved from here. This is council land, as far as I'm aware. But if I'm wrong, we'll gladly move for you, sir. We'll gladly move. But you need to show us the evidence. What he's asking is because where all the students are here. Well, we gladly move. We gladly move if this is university land. But if it's council land, we cannot move. I have issued a parking ticket here, and they have stood up in court. Well, if you show us that this is university land, we'll gladly move, sir. But we've been here. We've been here for four years. We've been here for four years, and we've also talked to uh, staff who've been here. And they've told us always to move here that they can't touch us here. Now you're Sir. saying differently. Sir. Jesus Christ came to die on the cross and gave his life for you on that cross. He shed his blood for you on that cross. We've been coming here four years, Kieran, and they've never we've never been moved from here. But if 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 this is if this is council land, we'll move. Uh, if this is yeah. That wasn't our car. If if this if this is um, if this is not. Council land, we'll move. Yeah, but we've been coming here four years. Yeah, well, we, we've said the and our guys have never been moved. They didn't move the Jehovah's Witnesses. No, that's true. that's true. You know? Jesus Christ came to die on the cross. He gave his life for you. He shed his blood for you. He died that you may live. He died that you may have life. He died that you may be saved today and born again. That's why he died on that cross. He shed his blood for you. And if you come to know him as your Lord and Savior, you can trust them as your Lord and Savior today. The blood of Jesus Christ. You see, when Christ died, he died on the cross for you. He died shedding his blood for you. He died taking the punishment for you. He died taking the wrath that you deserved. He took your wrath. He took your punishment. Every time you lied, every time you stole, every time you slept around, every time you did something wrong, he died for you on that cross. And he shed his blood. And that's why it says, For God so loved the world, that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes on Him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. And you'll not perish, for God so loved the world, that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes on Him shall not perish, but have eternal life. You can have eternal life in Christ. You can have eternal life knowing Christ, that He died on that cross. He took your wrath and punishment and shed his blood for you on that cross. And if you said, Jay, it's just religion. Jay, you're just ramming it down our throats. No, you've, you've done wrong in your life. You've lied, you've, you've done things that are not right and you need to repent and turn away from it and turn to the Lord. 
You are to repent. You cannot stay in your sin. If you stay in your sin, God will judge you. You have to repent of the things that you've done wrong and flee to the blood of Jesus. Flee to the Lord who shed His blood for you. Flee to the Lord who gave His life to you. Flee to Him who shed His blood for you. Assalamu alaikum. You got a question, sir? Flee to the blood who shed for you on that cross, who gave His life for you on that cross, who died on that cross for you, who shed His blood for you on that cross, who gave His life for you on that cross. He died that you may live that He shed His blood that you may live. That's why He died on that cross. Oh, the deep, deep love of Jesus, vast, unmeasured, boundless, free, rolling as a mighty ocean in its fullness over me. Christ came and died in your place. He died on that cross that you may live. He died on that cross that you may have life. That's why He died. He was bruised for your iniquities. He was chastised for the things that you did wrong. He took your punishment, your judgment upon that cross. That's what He was doing. The blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sin. And He was dying in your place. It says in Isaiah, He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon Him. And by His stripes we are healed. The Lord has laid on Him the iniquity of us all. And He died in our place. He died in our place. He died in your place. He died in your place. The Messiah died in your place. He took your punishment, your judgment. That's why He died. He took your punishment. He died in your place and took your wrath that you may live, that you may have a life and be forgiven and escape hell and judgment to come. So don't take porn, don't take drugs, don't get drunk, don't sleep around. And remember that Christ died and took your punishment. Remember that Christ took your wrath, that He took your judgment, that He died in your place. That He gave His life for you and shed His blood for you. And gave His life that you may live. He gave His life that you may live and shed His blood that you may live and died that you may live and gave his life that you may live. That's why he died on that cross. That's why he shed his blood. So my friends, remember the blood of Jesus. Remember Christ. He died for you on that cross. Remember the blood. The Lamb of God shed his blood. The Lamb of God died in your place and he took your wrath that you may come to God and know God as your Savior. You see, God knows what you're doing. He knows the things that you do wrong. He knows where you've been. He knows the mistakes that you have made. And He came and He shed His blood on that cross for you. That you may be forgiven, that you may be cleansed, that you may be washed, that you may know His mercy, that you may know His grace. That's why He died on that cross. That's why He shed His blood. That's why He gave His life. That you may know Him, that you may be forgiven and cleansed.